Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Kitty. Guess what you guys, look, it is time for my auction. I said I would wait until I got 100 subscribers and I am a little, just a little over now. Um, but I said I would do it, so I am going to do it. I have, I think I've chosen some good stuff, some good paintings. Um, I hope you all like them. I also decided to do um, some coasters and some jewelry. So um, the auction is going to be live. It'll be Saturday, October 12th, um, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, USA only. For right now, please, and I'm so very sorry, um, but just USA only for now. Um, the winner does pay shipping, and if I do not have your information, um, please email me at acrylicartbykitty at gmail.com. So that is the email that you will email me at uh, with your, your name, your address, your email, and you know all that good stuff. And uh, which piece that you had won. Um, I will do my best with keeping track. I, I do do all this by myself. So I hope you guys are patient with me. Okay, let's get to uh, showing you guys. I'm excited. I'm so excited. Okay, so I decided to show you this stuff first. So if you guys watch my videos, you've seen these coasters before, obviously. Uh, let me bring them up for you. This is my set of greens. And they really did come out very pretty, I think. Of course, we all say that about all of our stuff, right? But they do they have been painted. They have my my uh, business name on the back with the little feet. All four of them have it. So the set, the starting bid, and I hope my prices aren't too high. I really do. I hope the starting bids aren't too high, but starting bid is $20 for the coasters. And let me try to, sorry, I don't want to get my head in there. <laughs> All right, I'm going to try to show you guys some of these. These are really pretty. Here's a green. It kind of reminded me of a, like a. A meadow maybe and like here is the stream I wish you could see it really close but it's not gonna let me I'm sure I'm sure but it really is very pretty um, and then this one was some gold and stuff like that. I thought that one was pretty cool in the copper so there's those two purple of course because well, we all do purple. There's some blue in there too. Those are the metallics. You can see some white, I hope. Let's see. Sometimes when I, there we go. How cool is that? Yeah, that's pretty. And then this one, blues. Blues, white, and black. I love this one too. <laughs> of course. And then this one is okay come on this one's got purple and blue and white i really wish it would show this one's very cool um this one is probably one of my favorites and they they all do have um i can put these on them if you, i'll be putting these back on them I just thought it was easier to show, and I just didn't want to take the chain off of this one, but I do have, um, I'm afraid this one isn't going to show if I bring it up too close, but, I'll find my camera, let's see, I love this one too, okay, so there's that one. I'm going to try not to make this too long. Well, here's my little pendant and earring set. And all the jewelry starting bid is $10. Like I said, I really hope that it's not too much, you know? You never know. These colors are the same as this one. 
Only there's just not as much gold in there. Let's see. I don't remember how I put it where it showed more colors. Yeah, get over there. But they are in there. There we go. Maybe. A little bit. Okay, so there's that. Okay, so there's those. Let me set these over here. I'll show you the paintings. Okay, you guys. So, 8 by 10s uh, This one was done on the New Year's Eve pour party with Christina Welch and Alan Welch. This is an 8x10, starting bid is $10. I love this one, very pretty. I love that co those colors. I believe those colors were Alan's choice. And if you guys watched my videos, you'll know that this came from my red and black series. There's a bunch of, uh, I don't remember how many tree rings I did on here, but I think that one came out very cool. So there's the 8x10s. And then this one, oh my god, I love this one. This is an older one also. And yes, I see that. This one is one that I did the same at the same time at the New Year's Eve pour party. Um, this one just came out awesome. It is resined. I did resin it. This one has just got some cool stuff going on in there. Love it. I love that up there. Isn't that cool? But this one is resined. This one is a 10 by 10. I wish it wouldn't do that. And they do have my thing in there. So this one's resin, so this one the starting bid is 25. And then this is another 10 by 10. Starting bid is 15. This is a tree ring that I did. Purples and blues. Love this one. I love how those rings came out. I hope you guys can see the colors really good. This one's pretty. These have all been, um, except for the one that was resined, these have all been varnished with Liquitex gloss varnish. High gloss varnish, I believe. Um, Another 10 by 10. This was my bottle bottom pour attempt. <laughs> and there is a video. I don't remember if I did the video on that already, but I know I've posted this video. So this is that one. The bottle bottom pour. All been varnished. Starting bid, $15. Oh, love this one. 10 by 10. Starting bid fifteen dollars, and this was my first. I think my first um, fire and ice pour. This one came out really cool too. Like they didn't even mix at all. It was very cool. I remember I did post the video for this one. There's that one. Okay. Try not to make it too long, guys. <clears throat> okay. 9 by 12s Starting bid, $15. Love this one. This was with uh, Prussian blue, uh, manganese blue, some white, and I, I don't think I put black in there, but I know I did put white in there. And this one came out just awesome. This is a flip cup. I think. I don't remember now. But this one's also been varnished. Love this one. 
this little guy right here just kind of developed. He was kind of cute. So pretty. I really love this one. Because, you know, blues. Some cool stuff in there. There's that one, 9 by 12 $15 starting bid. Another 9 by 12 $15 starting bid. And this one was my first attempt at a, um, the Saran Wrap. <laughs> That's what I got. I don't, I haven't done one since, but, um, I will definitely be doing it again, for sure. And they, it has been varnished also. So there's that one. $15 starting bid. Okay. I have had this one for a while. These next three. 11 by 14. It's been varnished. And I absolutely love this one. This was, I, I did this quite some time ago. This was back when I had only been painting for maybe a couple of months or so. This was my, um, I want to say it was a boiler maker. And at that time I was getting so many dendrites in all of my paintings. Which really turned out cool, but... And they, I mean, they came out everywhere. So this one is very shiny. It is, it's, it's varnished. It's not resin. But I love this. This, the color is just awesome. Uh, blues and no, maybe that's Payne's gray. I honestly, it's been a while. I don't remember, but I know um, there is silver in there. You guys can see the silver. But this one is just cool. Love that one too. Love them all, but can't keep them all. So the starting bid for that one is $20. Okay, and another 11 by 14 that I've had for a while. Did it just around the same time as that one. This was a flip and drag. One of my first couple, I believe. And the same thing, I got dendrites on it from it which and they just stopped right here which was very cool like just stopped except for right here but this one is pretty cool too it's really soft through in here it's like they fade but they're very cool it's like a tree right here love that these of course were done with blues and you know black Love that one too. And they've all got my little stamp. Alright, that one, 11 by 14, $20 starting bid. And then this one is a 12 by 16 from my earlier days. Um, starting bid on this is 20 Yep, this was from my earlier days. Definitely blues and black. I don't remember. But they're the metallic blues. This has been varnished also. Try to get you see some stuff. This one's really pretty too. Been varnished also. So that is the 12 by 16 starting bid, $20. Okay, so if we have time and if you guys would like to, 
I did prepare more stuff if you guys would like to. If not, we can stop right there. Um, but I will go ahead and show you what I have. I decided to do a whole nother set. Here is some more jewelry. It's my owl. This is like the same colors as the one on the previous. I love that owl. I really can't show two at a time. But I love that. It's probably one of my favorites. Yeah, I see that so much, I think. <laughs> this green one. This green one's pretty cool. Please focus. Oh, it was right there. Oh my god, there it goes. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay. And here's a blue and black one. Oh my gosh. I love this one. This one's so cool. Keep it right there because it's focused. <laughs> and then here is one like some of the, a couple of the previous ones, but in, in the gold, I wish I could show you guys that. Oh, you can see it. Okay. And then there's these. More metallics. I did a lot with metallics. And another one. This one was actually done with the same as that black one. So here's this one. It's got a little bit of, I don't, I'm not really sure what color that is. I can't remember what painting it was either. Um, but it's pretty. And here is another set pendant and earring set and it came off the same as that one and the other black one from the paint drippings I hope you guys can see that okay yeah I keep saying I don't want to make the video too long and look I'm making it too long so and then these coasters so still jewelry 10 these coasters are 25 starting bed just because um like it took so much resin and so much I took so much more time on these. I love these so much. Oh my gosh. They are so sparkly. And they have been done in black with my little thing and my thing, my business name. And they do have little feet. But I love these so much. These came out so cool. There's the other two. Real close. Try to get ya. That's cool. I don't know, I like sparkly stuff, but okay guys. So there's those. Alright. And then I have 12 by 12. Dutch pour that I did not long ago. Well, I think it's been a while, but this was with the greens and yellow, and I did the cerulean blue in the middle there. This was one of my first few Dutch pours. I actually have two more that are just the green and yellow and gold. I have two more of those, and then um, I have like a set of three of the purple up with the background what is that? Purple Lake? Yeah, I have a lot. Um, so this is a 12 by 12. Starting bid is $20. So there's, now these are only if you guys want to continue. If not, then that's okay. That's okay. I will hang them all back up. It's okay. <laughs> Alright, so this one is one of my oldies but goodies. This one has been resined. 
and come on this one is just so cool it's got purple and blue and yellow white this one came out really cool but this one has been resined I love it so it has been resin so the starting bit is $25 I really wish that would not do that come on I want you guys to see okay and then we have gotta make sure they're right hold on Alright, so we have one of my first diptychs, you guys, and I did mark them on the back. <laughs> I did make, put a little mark on the back, just so I know, and you know which way they go, but you can put them any way you want. It really doesn't look like it matches though, does it? But it does right here. But yeah. These are resined also. These are 8x10s. And for the set, um, starting 40. But these, I love these so much. And they do have that, that sparkle. That's where those pendants came from, was this, this pour. All the drippings from them. These are very pretty. Let's see, where did I show you? And this one did have a little bit of dendrites going on. On this one. A little drop of gold there. That was kind of weird. But you guys can see. These are so cool. I hope I'm not going too fast. Or too slow. Okay. So these ones are resined. 8 by 10 set. Starting bid 40. Okay. Almost done, you guys. Next is, I don't think I did a video on this. I think I was just playing around. Oh, this one is so cool. This one is green, yellow, and gold. Maybe I did. Yeah, I did do a video. So it's all varnished and finished and done and shiny. And that gold is just awesome. I wish it would pick it up, but... Oh, there we go. Right here. This one is so cool. This one is a 10 by 20 And the starting bid on this one is 30 Love these. Now these ones, I think I still need to put my stamp on a couple, but that that won't take long. So, and and like I said, this is only if you guys want to keep going. I mean, I just wanted to make sure that I had some stuff picked out, and you know, I know people have things to do and stuff like that. So here is another 10 by 20. This was my attempt at colors that I weren't, weren't, that I wasn't sure of. This one is also a starting bit at 30. Um, I do have another one that is hanging on my wall because I switch them out. Um, but this one came out pretty cool. It's kind of earthy. trying to let you guys see but not take so long I know this video is long already and I'm so sorry but I'm so excited I'm finally doing an auction for you guys next up will be a subscriber giveaway I gotta get that together so keep sending people over you guys 
keep sending new subscribers and I'll keep doing this stuff and so there's that one one more one more of my favorites okay this one is just so cool it's another 10 by 20 starting bid is 30 and it came out just really cool this is my little three not sure what I was going for, but my three little Dutch pours. But it's the green, yellow, and gold that I was so stuck on for a while. <laughs> they came out. I love it. Uh, got a little bit of blue in there. Come on. It's that one. And this little guy, this little guy, some blue right there too. Oh, so cool. These are so cool. All right. All right, you guys, that, that's it. So like I said, the second set, if, um, if, if you guys still want to hang out and, um, hang out longer you know then I have more prepared for you guys if not then we can stop at the first set that's a, that's fine with me um, but yeah so I'm excited I'm ready I hope you guys will join me I appreciate every single one of you guys um, thank you for sending subscribers you know who you are and um, I, I look forward to seeing you all there and live. I'm rusty. I think I've only done one. So please bear with me. Um, like I said, I'm doing this all on my own. So it'll take me a minute to, you know, get a little groove going. But I'll get it. And um, I can't wait to see you guys Saturday, October 12th, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time and I'm very excited. I hope to see you guys there soon. Um, I will See you then Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed it uh, Thank you guys. Bye